G V I I'm coming of I'm coming of I'm coming of I'm coming of I got enough money I'm coming of I'm coming of I smoke enough girl I'm just coming of I'm coming of I drink enough liquor I'm coming of so let's get into today's video. Today we will be doing a Valentine's Day lookbook. I got 10 looks for y'all. Disclaimer, if y'all hear my babies in the back, you already know what it is. You see me, you see the kids, you see the kids, you see me. Me. Shit. Yes, me. <laughs> so, like I was saying earlier, we we're going to do a Valentine's Day lookbook for 2022. I got 10 looks for y'all. And... That being said, we just gonna jump into the video. Alright, YouTube, so this is the first outfit. We got a nice glowy top. This was thrifty. So I don't remember exactly which wow. store I got this at, or if this is something that's really good. Nice off the shoulder. Mama! You can do it up, or I prefer honestly off the shoulder. And it's nice and glowy. It's like a, a mauve color. And then I paired it with some light pink jeans. These, my mom just recently gave these to me. So I think she probably got them at Marshalls. They have like a tiny little rip in them. And then I paired them with my white um, ego quilted heels. So I'm going to put some white polka dots on it. So this is a look. This could be daytime or nighttime, depending on what type of flow you're trying to do, you're trying to be out. Whether well, it be on a whole brunch, date night, a yeah. nice, easy flow. But you know, Valentine's Day is all about pink. So, you can see a further look. Um, this is my infinity choker that my fiance got me, I believe, for Christmas, for my anniversary. For our anniversary. Um, and then I paired it with this Juicy Couture heart necklace because it's only fitting for Valentine's Day. Um, I got my rose gold Nanette Lepore watch. This I got from TJ Maxx. And then I got the matching Juicy necklace. And yeah, and then I just got some simple stud earrings. Keep it nice and simple. Um, you know, you just always just want to have some jewelry together so you look you know, put together accessories go a long way. And to throw it in, I have the Michael Kors mom purse as well. So we kind of doing like a little monochromatic look over here. So, you know, I like the crossbody because, you know, you don't have to do the whole, whole bag thing. You know, that's kind of, you know, everybody's always on the go. So, you can just throw the crossbody over the shoulder bag and you're just ready to go. So, and this is the arm from four. So, I love the look. The heels, they are comfortable. They're like, I believe, they're probably like three inches. Um, I don't do the high heels, the stiletto heels. They're not comfortable for my feet. I have flat feet, so that's not really a look for me to do those stiletto high heels that I'm comfortable. I like to be comfortable. Cute and comfortable, sexy and comfortable is a look. It's a vibe. Don't forget that. You ain't got to be uncomfortable and sexy because you don't want to be throwing off your whole outfit and now by the end of the night you walking barefoot or in the sandals. It's not a look. So yeah, this is a look. Like this is cute. This could be day to night, depending on how you want to do it. You want to pair it with some 
I would say some nice lace up sandals you can do it for the day and if you want to dress it up in the night you can wear some heels I'm going to show it to y'all with the heels because you know elevation is key you wear a heel you feel elevated you look good so I'm going to do this and then I'm going to probably pair it with my Cape Robin studded first pick heels and then I'm um, probably going to pair it with this black Gucci bag just to break up the color scheme. You know, you can always never go wrong with black. So I'm going to try this on now we can get into the Look guys, I'm gonna come closer so you guys can see the necklace, the chain, the bag, the shoes. So this is it, this is cute. Um, I left it open just so you guys could see the um necklace you guys. I left it open so you guys could see the chain. Um normally I would just I'll be closed because you know that's just what type of time I'm on, but um to each its yeah. own. You can button it even lower. For y'all girls that's hot girl summer, y'all can do that too. But I feel like this is cute because, you know, it doesn't show too much skin. It's just enough. It's, the fabric makes you feel nice, luxurious, rich. And it doesn't look cheap. It feels good. Even though it's $6, it don't look $6. You know what I'm saying? Budget. You can look cute on a budget. I'm an advocate for that. You don't have to have a lot of money to look expensive. Just put yourself together. You got it. So this is the look. Okay, this is a very cute date night. Valentine's Day date night. So yeah, that's it. Alright, so the next look we're gonna do is this dress. It's like a magenta color from Giddy, GD, I don't know, G I T I. Um I also got this on clearance. I think I paid about like 10 bucks for it. Um, it shows, it has a very high neck. It's ruching all over the dress. Long sleeves. I would consider this probably midi length. So at your ankles. So I'm going to pair it with, once again, these shoes. <laughs> and I'm going to pair it with the black bag again. You know, you know, you know, black, so I'm gonna put this on and we're gonna get to it. Alright, y'all. This is probably one of my favorites because I just like the high neck look. Very elegant. Very classy. Still very classy, not showing much. Favorite. 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 Like anybody's shape can fit into this. Like, it just feels like butter on your skin. Favorite. keeping everything nice cute and simple and then the shoes so yeah i really like this the color the color is just beautiful. magenta is like such a nice color magenta fuchsia i believe it's magenta fuchsia i love the color and this is like this is definitely you can do this in the daytime but this is definitely nighttime material um that way you don't you know sometimes the a blazer or any type of outerwear jacket shawl it can throw off a look so this is this will keep you covered it's long sleeve so you won't be too hot in it because the material is nice and light and i love this so Ooh. this might have to be oh tools child to the next look all right y'all so next look is this dress it's still got a tag on it because i bought this i think i want to say i bought this if not black friday then the day after christmas i think i bought this and it was on sale i think i paid like 30 bucks for it from zara 
no coincidence, my first daughter's name is Zara, so I just like to shop here because no pun intended. Um, it's just, oh, it's just, I love the material. Um, the thing about real leather and the PU leather, I mean, to each his own, I feel like if you can get a nice quality one, do it because it looks good. I'm going to tell you to break a bank just so you can have real leather. The PU leather looks good as long as you know it's not going to like strip and because you have some of them, you wear it and the next day or if it sits in your closet, it starts to strip. That's not a look. So this, I doubt it's going to shrimp. I doubt it's gonna um strip. It has gold hardware on it, nice leather collar. It also has the ruching. This is nice because it like what's the word I'm gonna say? Like I just gave birth to two kids, so this ruching I like it because it covers the areas that I'm a little subconscious about, and you know that works in my favor. Um, but this is like oh, this is my this is my favorite. Um. I just, this would be my probably number one maybe Valentine's Day look because I've never worn, you know, I take that back. I have worn red for Valentine's Day, but this is just it. Like, oh, this is just everything. This is probably my favorite. Um, haven't really tried it on with like a full look yet, so I can't wait to see what this is going to look like. And then I'm going to pair it with... I'm going to pair it with the red. Gucci bag. So he's doing like a monochrome look. And I'm gonna pair it with these heels again. The Cape Robin study heels. So I'm gonna keep it nice, clean, and simple. So I'm gonna change it to this and we about to see how it looks, child. Now this this is everything. Uh I did not realize in the inside it's like a suede. Oh, this feel like brown sugar baby it's just the perfect length paired it with the red bag for a monochromatic look once again you get these heels this is everything i just love how it feels i feel like money i feel like money i feel nice i feel good get into it get into it this is just oh i just love it like it just the dress speaks for itself. That's all. That's all you gotta say. Um, this this one has a good look, child. I don't know if anything gonna be able to top this, but this is indeed my favorite. Um, I think something like this. They had a black one, but I'm trying to stay away from the black because I have a habit. My whole closet at one point, half of 50% of it was black. So I'm trying to branch out to where I'm getting to more different color schemes so I don't walk around looking like a straight funeral home. So, this is it. Ooh. This is it. So, we about to get into the next one. Okay, guys. So the next outfit is this dress. I got this at Forever 21, once again on clearance, for about eight bucks. Um, this is, it's like a velvet, um, it's like a, I would say like a creamish color. Um, it's lovely, it's definitely, I would say, midi style. I wouldn't say maxi because it does not really hit the floor, but it's close enough. It's sleeveless, so this is nice. I live in Florida, so you know, just I don't have to wear like I don't really like to wear the jackets because they ruin my outfit. But um, these looks are just inspirational, you know. You can this is just an idea for you to you know do your thing on Valentine's Day, and you can do it on a budget. So this dress is lovely. I like the way it fits me. The only thing that I hate this dress is a pain in my to put on I don't know what it is but this it's a love-hate relationship I like it y'all see when I put it on it's gorgeous but it's just shambles to get this thing on I feel like I'm fighting dogs like I'm fighting for my life like I don't know what's going on but this ain't it but you know 
know, it look good, so a girl's gotta do what a girl's gotta do. So I'm gonna do this dress, pair it with these heels again, it's clear, and I also have a clear bag with the gold accents, so that's the look I'm about to do. So we about to get into it. Here's a dress. Um, I don't need to work out today because this was a whole full body workout trying to get big on. But for y'all, because I love y'all, it's just. Oh, I was about to say, forget it. I ain't gonna do it. But look at this. All of that. All that stress and that struggle for this. So you can pair with anything white, cream, or pop of color, whatever you want to do. This is nice because it just the material makes it look nice, upscale, elegant, sexy without showing too much. Once again, high neck. I love me a high neck. Sleeveless. Um, this is definitely you could dress up, dress down. You want to dress down some sandals, go right ahead. But as I mentioned, I got the heels on. I got the clear heels. So basically kind of like a nude look, monochromatic look. Cream and crystal. Oh, I like that. Um, champagne vibe very much. I'm doing this for brunch. No, just get into the look. I really like this. So we got to get to the next one. Okay, so this is look number seven. This dress means a lot to me because my fiance gave this to me on Mother's Day. And I just love it. It's going to be breakfast at Tiffany's, summer brunch on a yacht somewhere. You know, just looking very elegant. My daughter's trying to touch the camera and the child. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. So we'll get to the next outfit. You're probably wondering, like, dang, she said we're the black. Okay, here it is. Nice, satin, silky. You just feel like, once again, butter on your skin. This could be day or night. I would probably wear this at night because I personally like to wear black at night, but to each his own, you do you, honey. But um, this is a nice dress from Zara. Um, I definitely got this during Black Friday. Um, I wasn't able to try it on because they had closed all their fitting rooms, so. But, I don't even know if I actually even tried it on because I bought it, I just figured since it was nice and I already knew it was a wrap dress, so it tied, so this is very figure flattering. It'll fit the figure nice. Looking like an hourglass, looking like milk. But um, this is black, so for all y'all who really don't like get into the color and not really feeling a Valentine's Day color scheme. Y'all can do the black. Black is best. I mean, you cannot go wrong with black. So this is long sleeve, so you know, once again, you don't have to worry about the jacket. So I'll be doing this, pairing it with the black purse here, and I'll be pairing it with these. Shoes that once again I also thrifted. I love them because look, they have the studs on them. So I'll give you a little accent since this dress is very plain. But trust me, you pull it all together, it's gonna look like this. this is the black. Very classy, very chic, very elegant. It was a little too cleavage, a little boobed out for me. So I did a black tank underneath. If you have like a nice lace bralette lace halter anything with lace to just dress it up just further uplift the look that's nice i didn't have one probably gonna go get one to make just to make sure this look is getting what it's supposed to give because i'm really liking this and i think it's gonna turn out that nice so it has a little tie thing here so you just my little the American women. Y'all know about the island way, the international way to tie shoes, but no. But um, yeah, this is it with the bag, nice and simple. And then the heels. Yeah, 
this is it. I love it. Yes. So we gotta get into the next thing. Okay, so this is the next outfit. This is one of my favorite black pieces. This is a black blazer dress that I bought from this is a black blazer dress that I brought from Zara. Um, it's long sleeves. It's like a little mini. It's a little mini. Um, and the cut in it was really, the plunge neckline was super deep for me. Listen, to each his own. The girls that get it, get it. And the girls that don't, you already know what I'm talking about. Um, so what I did, I had sewed it. I had sewed it myself and then what I did was to make it nice I added this little B pin that I got from Amazon for about like it came with another B pin you'll see it because um, I added it to my beret that I got from Shein that's in um, a couple more looks to come up so I added this B pin just to give it a little more oomph, a little more just dress it up so this is the dress back is plain I'm gonna pair it with just for a pop of color sake I'm just gonna throw on so that way we're not doing black on black you can do the black that's up to you I'm gonna pair it with the red and then I'm also gonna do these black heels so you about to get into this look, look get into it. this is very classy very sophisticated I love this to my fiance's birthday dinner um, I love it because it has the velvet has the split sleeves like I said I had sewn it it really punches down to here but I had sewn it so you still get the lapel look I had sewn it all right through in here this is a little too deep for me and I believe they still have this in Zara so you can still get it um, once I said I got this B pin from Amazon just to add a little something extra to it. It got the not waist. And this is just this is just sophisticated, sexy, and it's not nice. I love this. So I'm about to get into the next look. look is this white dress all white a lot of ruching um this is it in the back i got this from diva boutique it's a boutique in miami but they also have like an online boutique so i purchased this is also on sale i think i got this for i think i got this for 20 bucks so this isn't bad i haven't worn this yet so this is nice. I love it. The long it got the little puff sleeves. Has the nice um, fitted ankle. Not ankle. Oopsies. The nice fitted wrist sleeves. So I like that everything's fitted. The ruching is all the way in the back. I'm going to pair it with these white heels from Evo. I'll probably pair in black as you've seen it in the upcoming video. And then I have this bag I'm gonna do it a clear look or if you want to pop a color you can do you can also do the red I'll probably do the red it's Valentine's Day so at least do some do a little something you ain't finna wear the red or the pink these have the accessories. Accessories is key to everything. They uplift, elevate your look. Like, listen, you already know what time it is. Just put yourself together. You don't need a lot of money to do it neither. You just get into it. Just make sure you plan accordingly. Trust me, your look is in front every time. So I'm about to try this on. We about to get into the look. Okay, so this is the dress. It's on. It's plunge, but because it, I don't know, it's not that deep, so this is good enough for me. It has a nice puff cap sleeves going all the way down. I love that. I'm going to offer this because since I just had a baby, 
while I'm working out and trying to get rid of all of this. This is covering it and it's just doing me justice. I got the red bag. I got the white heels. I'm just loving this look. It's just everything. I don't know what to really pick from now, what we're going to do, but these are not got options. I'm going to spin for you. We got the final, the last, final look. Look number 10. Um, a little bit something different. We got a little bit more accessories for this one. So I really hope you guys like it. So, Okay, guys. So for the final look, we got this white shirt from Shein. I'm going to back up so you guys can see has a little ruching on the side with strings i just love that and then we got this plaid skirt that i got from hollister so i'm gonna carry this and then we also have this hat from Shein. i believe you can still get this it's like a blush color and then i this is the other b pin that came with the set that i showed you other that other earlier that was on the blazer so it came in a set of two. So I added it on his just to add a little extra something. And then we're going to pair it with the red bag. Maybe I'll do the black. I think I'll go with the black. I think I'm going to do the black just to break up since the red. It's a lot of red going on. And then also because I'm doing black quilted mules. So... This look is different, so get ready for this one. Okay, guys, so here's the look. The hat is a little off kilter. So I got my options, so, which y'all know what to do with it. Is. So this is, the look. this is the shirt. I just love it. Give it very much party. Bonsoir. Very much a vibe. I'm really liking this outfit. Really daytime or nighttime. This is the look with the black heels, the black mules. I just love this. So with that being said, guys, I hope you guys have a happy Valentine's Day. Whether y'all single, taken, or whatever y'all situation is. Lots of love to y'all guys. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we'll see y'all later.